away from the theater of war. The Nigerian military is under investigation. Reuters, a foreign media outlet, has accused Nigerian soldiers of carrying out a secret and systematic abortion program since 2013, in which they allegedly terminated at least 10,000 pregnancies of women rescued from the enclaves of Boko Haram fighters or their wives in the northeast region. One after the other, senior military officers appear before the Special Independent Investigation Panel, by the National Human Rights Commission to investigate the matter. Women and soldiers described a room in Diwa Barracks where abortions took place. A 40 gray wall space like a hallway where women lay on floor mats and eat cockroaches and mosquitoes. So they were not only facing abortion but they were also placed in inhuman and degrading conditions. What is your response, General? It's wrong. It's false. Please, listen, these people should not look. They should not spoil our heads. They should not spoil. They should not discourage us from doing the job. Okay? Because they will sit down, sit down somewhere. Reuters. You can look at look at the name Reuters. Next to testify before the panel is the Chief of Defense Staff, General Lucky Irabo. He takes the oath before being quizzed by the panel. The record of Reuters in this report has it that the military accosted some group of women, or rather these women ran to the military as part of the uh, rescue operations, and the military took them in a truck, and also isolated their children again, and in this circumstance, took the children one after the other, covered their nose and their mouth together, and suffocated these children. It is not the responsibility of the Air Forces to begin to determine who is being stigmatized or who is not being stigmatized. So we have no hand whatsoever in all this, and I do not think we exist. And we trusted to the Air Forces, certainly there is nothing of this nature. In the coming days, more testimonies are expected to be given by other witnesses as the panel adjourns its sitting to Monday, May the 15th, 2023. The two reports separately published by Reuters on 7th and 12th of December 2022 also accused the military of carrying out an operation codenamed Operation No Living Things in which it allegedly massacred thousands of children in the Northeast region. But General Loki Rabo has denied these allegations, describing them as a ploy to demotivate soldiers who are currently in the theater of war. Nevertheless, this special independent investigation panel says it is determined to get to the root of the matter. Emperor Simon, Channels Television News.